It's your boy, Ryan O'Reilly. We're back with another episode of Movie Monday. Lori, hit it! Alright, so here we go. New format. Lori's going to read the back of the movies. Uh, we're going to see um, how long it takes me to uh, guess. Uh, what the movie is. And now she's like putting up a, a border. She's like <laughs> taking this very seriously. All right, Lori. Tula is 30 and unmarried, which means as a nice Greek girl, she's a failure. All her cousins did the right thing. Wait, wait, wait. Is this uh, fucking um, the Greek indie hit movie? Um, you know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah. Uh, I got it. It's. Um, like, just tell me the fucking title. I, I got it. I my know My Big I, Fat Greek yes, Wedding. Yes, My Big Fat Greek Wedding. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Uh, my Big Fat Greek Wedding. Uh, actually never seen it. However, um, it, you know, uh, sorry. I don't know. Um, I try to see everything. Joel Zwick. That's interesting. I wonder if he's the son of Ed Zwick. Um, look that up. You know who Edward Zwick is? No. Very, uh, very good director, so I just looked that up. No, the reason I give this movie props is uh, it uh, was for, it held the title for a very long time as the um, highest grossing independent movie of all time. As an independent filmmaker, I congratulate that. Um, even if I think the movie shit or whatever, the fact that somebody scrapped together their own dollars and was able to make a movie and on top of that make a bunch of money for everyone else afterward good job plan is set the rules are clear if all goes right for danny oceans get rifters the oh, payoff is oceans 11 yeah I don't know. yeah <laughs> you know fun fact uh I, I think i've seen this one i haven't seen all of them but i'm actually not sorry mr soderbergh i am not and he's an independent guy, like, he's an, you know, I just don't like your style. I've seen, like, every single one of his movies, and I'm just, like, I just, uh, except for these, you know, they're more commercial, but, like, yeah, yeah, sorry, Stephen. All right. When Al Pacino and Robert De Niro square off. Okay, is this heat? Yes. Yes, dude, <laughs> give me that motherfucker right there. Fucking heat, Michael Mann. God, you've lost your your touch. But uh, Michael, uh, lately, I hope he gets it back. Um, have you seen this, Lori? No. Oh fuck. Okay. Um, first, it's a uh, LA movie. I'm a sucker for LA movies. LA is my favorite city, even though it's disgusting and dirty and like the most horrible place in the entire world. It's my favorite city. Um, Second, there was actually, uh, like, a... So, okay, here's where I'll go with that. Um, Michael Mann's ability in that movie to uh, uh, build up to a moment, to a scene, and uh, an a sequence, and completely deliver on it uh, through the music and everything, and then as soon as it hits, cuts, gets rid of every, anything. All you, all you hear is the sound. Music cuts out, that it, and it's just so visceral. It's so visceral that somebody actually recreated. There was a big, uh, uh, like, so this came out in like uh, 93 or something like that, 94. Um, and like two or three years later after that in LA, somebody recreated, like there's a big bank robbery scene, big heist scene, and they're like automatic weapons. And that's the reason cops in LA have automatic weapons now is because of this bank robbery. I mean, there's this like massive shootout and stuff like that. And it's because <laughs> like, and they were wearing like masks and body armor and like all the shit. It was like a real deal thing. So like, I, I mean, for LA, like, uh, yeah, I love Heat. Fuck, it's one of my favorite movies. Yes. The roguish yet charming Captain Jack Sparrow. Uh, Pirates of the Caribbean, the first one, I'm gonna guess. Because it's a VHS. The Curse of the Curse Black of the Black Pearl. Pearl. Yeah, this is the yeah. first one. <laughs> <laughs> Do they all just melt together with you? Um, Gore Verbinski, we've had him on here before. Um, you know, this one was actually, this one was great. 
um, is great because it was the first. It kind of like like the first Transformers movie, like just kind of has that like, y you know, it has like a, a just yeah special recipe. Like all the notes hit at the right time, the right moment. Um, have they overdone the franchise? A hundred percent. But uh, yeah, it's a good movie. Cosmopolitan called it one of the best. It seems everybody loves Blah Blah, the star-studded saga of four young sisters. Wait, I wasn't even paying attention. Start okay. over. <laughs> I'm okay, sorry, okay. I'm so thinking about something okay. else. It seems everybody loves Blah Blah, the star-studded saga of four young sisters based on the popular Louisa May Alcott novel. Uh, Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants? No. Oh. Uh, Alright, keep going. The Blah Blah are the March sisters. Joe, Beth, Amy, and Meg, living with their mother in New England while their father is off to the Civil War. And the March sisters are June, Allison, Janet Leigh, Margaret O'Brien, and a young and breathtakingly beautiful Elizabeth Taylor. Under the watchful eye of their mother, played by Mary Astor, they are the picture of a happy home. But the calm is broken by the arrival of Lori, the handsome grandson of a rich neighbor. I have no idea. Throw it to I've never seen that. Oh! Oh, this is like the original Little Women, huh? Yeah. See, if you had said, like, Cher and... Wait, isn't that... Or that's Mermaids or something. Never mind. Sorry. Um, I love how these boxes are filled with, like, a bunch of, like... <laughs> like, these hard... I'm not going to use the word chick flicks, but... Um, boy, yeah. Nope, never seen it. you never seen it? All right, that makes two of us. Uh, Janet Lee? Yeah. Janet Lee, you know who... Janet Lee was the lady in Psycho, the opening. Oh. So, and she's, um, what's her name's? Jamie Lee Curtis's. Yeah. Mom, yeah. All right, so that was, enough, that was a fun one. Um, uh, that's it. Uh, let me know how I did. Um, if you've seen any of these movies, leave a comment below. If you think somebody would appreciate or like this, share this video, um, leave a comment, like, subscribe, all that jazz. Lori, out. Three, two, one. What up, internet?